Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I know it's been a while since I've actually talked to you guys on camera, but here I am again. I hope you're all staying safe and healthy. I know we're living in like such a crazy time right now. We're actually in quarantine right now, so you're not supposed to go out unless you like need to get groceries and stuff like that. So it's kind of scary, like can't even go out to eat, can't even go to the store. It's just crazy. Like I'm a homebody. I'm such a homebody. I love being home, but this thing is I'm starting to go a little crazy like it's just so weird but make sure you guys stay healthy wash your hands drink lots of water don't go out just stay home dude like practically they're telling you not to do anything but stay home so please listen so we can get over this shit because i'm so freaking over it but yeah so for today's video i wanted to do something to maybe entertain you guys from this freaking craziness that's going on so my niece actually gave me the idea about this video she was like do something that has to do with tiktok so i have a tiktok i've only done one video but it's like i edited one of my old diys you know so it doesn't really count i don't know if i'm actually gonna do like all those dancing challenges and shit you know because i'm like embarrassed but like some of the stuff on there is like so freaking funny and you could tell people are so creative it's crazy and then there's some other stuff that i'm like why the hell would you even share that you know but to each their own but yeah what i wanted to do is recreate some diys that i found on there so i'm going to be recreating it three diys so yeah let's get started on those so this first diy comes from vintage stock reserve he shows us how to make some scrunchies so i made three different ones and he just pretty much breaks it down step by step with measurements and everything and he explained it really well and i've seen tutorials on how to do scrunchies before but i never actually like paid attention and seen how it's done so once I saw that he broke it down and it wasn't even hard, I was like, let me attempt it. And it's so easy. Now I feel like I want to do it with so many fabrics. So yeah, let's get started on that. This next tutorial comes from Marissa Melhorn and she shows us how to take two sweatshirts and combine them into one to do like a color block version and then she crops it to give it a cinch waist and I followed her exact steps but I put a little twist into mine. I also color blocked the sleeves on mine as you can see opposite colors. You could do any color that you like switch the sleeves if you want or not anyway is cool so yeah let's get started on that one.
last tutorial comes from Jess Renee Vega and she shows us how to turn some sweats into a three-piece outfit that consists of a crop top, some shorts, and a scrunchie. So I did all three of those. In her version, she actually does like Nike stitching on hers, but I don't have a machine that does that, so I didn't do it like that. But I have my scrunchie here, the shorts, and then the tube top. I did do a little mistake on the tube top because I didn't think about it. So you do have to end up folding the hem. And usually when you fold the hem, you fold it inside. So the side seam isn't going to show. But mine showed because I sh sewed it the wrong way. So other than that, I still think it came out cool besides that stitching. But it's all good. It's all good. So yeah, let's get started on that one. for my tiktok inspired diys i really hope you guys enjoyed them let me know if you want to see more of this stuff thank you guys so much for watching again and make sure you're staying safe healthy wash your hands stay home please stay home we're trying to get rid of this shit as soon as we can so we can get things back to normal so make sure if you're not subscribed subscribe my name is lucero i do diys and other stuff on here click the like button drop me a comment and yeah i'll catch you in my next video bye